everyone and happy new year. This is my first video of 2024 and of course it has to be Dragon Ball related because I'm obsessed and I can't stop. <laughs> Plus I have been playing a lot of breakers in my free time since the last time you saw this on the channel I have been absolutely on it. I've done every season pass so far even this one although technically I got to the level 50 unlock. I need to get to the level 71. And there's an event. There's so many events going on. Oh my god. There's so much to talk about when it comes to this game. But we're just going to jump right in. And if something comes up, then I'll, I'll, I'll say it as we go. I am realizing that this is probably my first video on this game in Season 4. And we're like halfway in now already through Season 4. This season introduced Broly <laughs> and uh, a really kind of open map, which is is interesting. I've not been on it enough to really gauge whether I like it or not, but it is certainly interesting. It's not quite as big as the map that was introduced with Vegeta, I don't think. But it is nice to finally feel like this game has, it has like fleshed out quite a bit because there's like double the amount of maps that we first had now i think there's six in total now i think uh obviously more raiders a bunch of new skills and abilities and and clothing items i've got so much in my in my wardrobe let's see the only thing is <laughs> uh since this is quite far in i don't know if we're actually going to see broly or not because a lot of people have learned how to fight him oh yeah i'm oolong right now just as a as a heads up Oh, Gaming Wolf. I've actually been with him before. <laughs> so let's see what character they're going to use. We're not on the new map. So this might not be, you know, a good example. You can see here, some people already have some of the new transfers. Uh, Orange Piccolo there. Uh, there's Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta. Beast Gohan as well. There's some good stuff in there. I'm just going to stick with my, um, my usual loadout. I'm going to be Oolong. At least for this round, I could be someone else at the moment. But there's a thing going on where if you play a match as the Oolong skin, it counts towards this this tally that they're doing, basically. And if they get enough matches played in the skin, everyone gets rewards. I had it. <laughs> Why not? I like, I like buying stuff from this game at this point. Let's go. Bingo. Woo! They also added all the bingo dances, like it's separated into three emotes. It's so good. The fact that they actually said, yeah, you can do it for the in-game currency and not actual money. I would have paid actual money for the bingo dances, I'm just saying. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not going to remember everything like that I had and didn't have in previous recordings of this. So, okay. <laughs> so we're just going to go in. Here's how to launch. Find the power keys. Ooh, we've already got a civilian. That's nice. It's a good first step, especially considering I feel like Frieza really gets a lot out of killing. Well, he gets a lot out of specifically killing the Mechians, so I guess we should be on the lookout for that. I feel like I feel like playing Oolong is weird because oh, maybe it was just in a cave, but like it, it felt like the camera was really zoomed in, and I never. Oh yeah, it happens in a cave. I don't think I ever noticed that. Unless I was playing Oolong. <laughs> That's because I'm sure it does that all the time, but it's weird. But yeah, playing as Broly is actually kind of difficult because at first, right, people were saying, oh, he's broken, he's overpowered, blah, 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 blah. You know, the usual stuff that people do when a new raider comes out. And now, oh boy, is it the opposite? Uh, I've played a few Broly matches where I've been Broly. And oh my God, I have no defense against people that absolutely just rush me down. And uh, since then, the dodge meta became a thing where because of the super transfers, hopefully you'll get to see this, but basically Broly has a thing where the Dragon Balls are not in the match when you go against Broly. Instead, you get these things called super transfers. And depending on when you collect it or when it falls, rather, will give you essentially like a Dragon Ball change. Thanks but uh synced to the level of the raider so you know level two raider will get you a level two power like transfer super transfer and then uh you can use that basically indefinitely and people learned that man get having that and like you know unlimited supers and dodging out of the way is really good for distracting the raider <laughs> to the point where it became like its own meta essentially uh, there are some skills that really help with dodging. 
Wow, we are level three already. Holy. That's pretty good. Well, in that case, there's no reason for me to really be down here, because uh, now my mission would should just be to try and get keys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, uh, going against Broly is fairly easy if you're not playing evasive. Really, <laughs> it, it seems kind of like anti-Raider gameplay, but the idea is if some people are like, really going for you i feel like the best option is to just kind of run away because <laughs> uh okay so here we go let's go and get some of these uh let's go oh wait was it down there was it down with me was there like one chest i didn't get i think there was let's go back down are they going down there to get it no it's here oh is it in here great you know what to do with that key. no yeah it's it's below me what I could have sworn that I was checking all around for that. Uh, where, where's the hole? Where is it? Where is hole? Not here. I think it was too too far in. Okay, let's go down here again. Oh, <coughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's in that one area. Oh, I know where it is. It's in this one area. This one there here. Okay. Well, that's fine. I should have checked this, but I didn't. Hey, yeah, there we go. Okay. Up we go. Let's go and um, this freezer doesn't seem to be doing a whole lot. Uh, let's go and get this key and then we'll call it good. I also give this dragon ball to this guy because looks like they're collecting them. So uh, here you go. Okay. And the, it's wait here. That's a new power yeah, there we go. Key. Place it now. Okay. Got them all. I have an ability on my my standard build, which is what I'm using now. I'm not using anything special. Where if I place the last key, uh, I gotta go. If I place the last key, I basically place it really, really quickly. But I ain't gonna be placing any last keys if Zarbon keeps hitting me. Good thing I had a shield thing. Oh my goodness. I really like Orange Piccolo, right? I like his kit. The only thing is, I'm not sure about the fact that he's mostly got melees, but they do a lot of damage. I've seen I've seen them like absolutely destroy Guldo in one combo, which is actually kind of wild. Okay, so the next the next key is over there. And if I get a chance to get over there, I'll show you what I mean by my keys going very quickly. It depends on if they want to get him down or not, I guess. Does he have some Dragon Balls? Hey! You serious? Yeah, he did! <laughs> Woo! That one, mate! Phew! <laughs> Gotta go! He did have- he does have Dragon Balls, though. Uh, let's- uh, let's inform the others. Dragon Ball Freezer. <laughs> I, now I, need your help. I know. <laughs> He's like sad about it, I guess. I don't know if that's like a common thing that people do, but I like to do that. Oh, great. This isn't good. Do they know where it is? Uh, I could I could sacrifice myself for the greater good. Okay, he hasn't they haven't used it yet, so he probably doesn't know it's there or it's like a hunch, right? Oh god. I used to have double jump on this build and I don't now. Alright. They're gonna fight him? Well, I. I could. I could do this. You know, I'm doing this. Whee! Okay, <laughs> good enough. <laughs> We at least get full power on that, so that's nice. As in, like, full speed bonus. God, I remember back in the beta days, you'd get so much speed bonus. No. Friend. I know a lot of people have been running um, double stun meta as well. <laughs> I, I say meta. I don't really know how meta these things are, but, like, you know, 
they have like a double stun thing going on so that because oh no well you know what you can have it Summoned by the radar. Oh no, what are you gonna do? Now, Level four or invincibility? <laughs> Come on. Done. I will grant your wish. No one cares. I mean we probably do care quite a bit, but it's fine. <laughs> Here, have a drink. Woo! <laughs> that was scary. Yeah! Come on, Freezer! Yeah! Whoa! 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 Yeah! Serious? Okay, well, that was cool looking, but it wasn't really that helpful. Oh! <laughs> Alright. I would like. Damn it. I would like one of these things, but they are okay. Okay. Oh. <laughs> That's an ability that I got from uh, Hercule. Funnily enough, it allows you to basically save yourself one time. Okay. Damn, we were doing so well too. This might have to be an escape time machine thing for me. Because I'm not going to be able to do anything until I get my... My change back again. They just kind of... You know, like, oh, oh, oh. They're trying to bait people. Change! It'd be a bad idea. I've done it before. Hello, friend. <laughs> How you doing, Oolong? Oolong time no see. Um, there's nothing. Wow, this place is really just wrung dry. Which I suppose is a good thing. Everyone was kind of prepared. It's just that no one was no one was thinking that Frieza would get the Dragon Balls, despite the fact that I warned people that Frieza had the Dragon Balls. Zabana! <laughs> I did not see him at all. No, Zabon! You know what? I just got a premium ticket from the Piccolo event. So let's quickly do that. This is like a guaranteed good summon, if I remember correctly, right? Yeah. Special lineup, four star or better skill guaranteed. Now, the thing is, I have a lot of these. I actually pulled on this one a few times, and I got so many of the five stars that people are after. Duplicates, of course. I got, like, sprint, energy field, instant transmission. So many times. It's actually wild. <laughs> All these times I've been like, oh, I really want it. And I never get them, and I finally got them, and now I've just I've got too many of them. I can't hold all of these five stars. Ha! Ah, will it be something I don't have? I mean, there's not that much I don't have, to be fair. Ah, uh, you know, <laughs> again, another one that I would have really loved early on. But hey, you know what? That's nice. <laughs> another day, another battle. Let's see. Will we actually get a Broly this time? I mean, hell, did I even have a chance to show off the Ginyu Force last season? I don't remember. I did when I streamed the game a bunch, <laughs> but like actually getting the Ginyu Force on video, I don't remember if I actually did that or not. So I'd be down for either, to be quite honest. I'm also curious what the next Raider is going to be. Like, I know that we had Broly leaked essentially and i think at some point really early on they had some like keywords to to basically suggest that broly was going to be available it would also be cool if we got z broly i don't know how they'd do it differently <laughs> because well no he does have different moves um but yeah it'd be cool if we had z broly as a choice as well 
maybe even if it was just as a skin like and, and the fact that they are very willing to change up the formula because broly starts at level two so it is it is nice to know that they have ways of like you know spicing it up uh, and changing the way that the raider is uh designed which is nice and it does basically open up the idea that <clears throat> maybe we will have like goku black goku black rose fused zamasu maybe that'd be kind of cool um if they decide to do super i mean they're also not afraid to dip into gt stuff as as is you know they already have some transfers and outfits from gt so why not <laughs> we could have the dragons or you know super baby actually baby would be a good idea i think baby would be a great idea basically vegeta but not because <laughs> he has the golden azaru form doesn't he holy orange piccolo jesus you think uh yeah broly okay what do i want to do against broly i could do this one because this is basically my fight me build uh it's not listen i don't i don't necessarily play this to the meta games a lot of the time like i don't have all the best skills i don't even know what the best skills are nowadays but um because i don't really pay attention to that stuff i just have like builds i like to use against certain people and this one is definitely up there because of uh unconscious control uh power to change the future you're all going to pay so it's basically a case of like you know if people die i can go and power myself up um and i can fight real good like <laughs> also uh i've for the longest time not realized that angry shout as a survivor works the same as it does a raider so if i'm getting like caught out of a combo or something and beaten up i can shout my way out of it which is actually very nice i didn't think to use it like that before Woo! <laughs> let's go as you can see i've got i am rocking the golden gi because of course <laughs> someone's rocking golden piccolo this is what the anniversary event things have been have been these golden outfits which are absolutely hideous and i love them <laughs> it really it really speaks to me because i used to wear a complete gold suit in uh, final fantasy 14 yeah also you'll see a lot of people in like anniversary shirts because they they have a pack right <laughs> i don't get this they have a pack of anniversary t-shirts oh god i'm leaving jesus christ thank you hello uh, sorry i needed to go uh, they have a pack of anniversary shirts which costs like oh my god so much money it's just the same shirt but like different colors of it there's one that's like a gold like a, what i'm wearing now and one that's a silver similar and it's just t-shirts but that bitch cost four thousand points like four thousand tp medals which is like 30 quid for t-shirts <laughs> listen they've they've had some bad deals in terms of like you know uh cost of things uh okay so there's a super transfer also you'll notice a severe like difference in audio quality in some of trunks lines because they gave him some new ones oh here we go yeah uh, they gave him some new ones in the Brody thing and I, I, and the Brody update. And I really wish that they had updated the old ones because now you get this weird disconnect where sometimes like trunks will sound one way in, but it, it feels like it's something that they're doing like over time, right? Because one of the things I noticed, I don't know when this happened, but you can ping things and suddenly your character will actually say something like, Hey, I want this. Whereas like before, I don't think they did that. At least I don't remember doing that. I'm like ADHD brain all over the place right now because I remember I was talking about the shirts. Yeah, it's crazy because some, yeah, some of the stuff like pricing wise is okay, actually. It's like pretty good pricing for, especially when stuff is on sale, you know, you get some nice stuff for a little, a little amount of TP. Sure, it builds up over time, but the fact that they're asking so much for shirts, you know what oh, especially the gold ones. It's just a materials change. It can't be worth 300 more TP medals from a, a standard shirt just to get a gold one. It's actually wild. 
Okay, so where haven't we been? Okay, there's lots of chests over there that haven't been opened. Let's go and get these. Yes, I must remember that this is my my fight me build. Use it quick. Uh, which is mostly actually uh, made for evasion and reactionary combat. As in like uh, one of the things that was done against me, well, which I really like. Thank you. Which I adapted. Close was basically you you keep dodging and distracting broly and so you either win by distracting broly or you uh make him not pay attention to you because he's like okay well you're just dodging i'm not going to pay attention to you and then you destroy him with supers of course the downside <clears throat> the downside of having this super transfer system is that you don't get to decide what character you're playing as uh, it is random between Vegeta and Goku, uh, and then the last form being Gogeta. But that means that if you have a specific super attack that you like in your transfers, you won't be able to use that because... Oh, no! Uh, you won't be able to use that because, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's predetermined already about, like, the characters that you're going to get, essentially. What are they doing? What are they fighting? Who are they fighting? Oh goodness. Uh hello. Woo! Uh, oh! Jesus. Whoa! Oh no! Protect me, Godlin! <laughs> uh, God, I'm at least safe thanks to that <laughs> that thing, but like, goddamn. I, I could help, I guess. I don't know how much help I would be, but you never know. I just wanted enough time to get away to be able to use the, uh... Ally down. Okay, ah! let's go. Watch out for That's a new power key. Oh my god, he is just really just killing. <laughs> oh my god. He is absolutely destroying some people. Yeah! <laughs> oh god. Uh. Oh, woo! 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 -hoo! Woo! Oh my god! How am I dodging these? Uh -huh. Okay, we gotta go down here. The startup system for oh. the super time machine is ready. Come on, Oolong. Save me. I don't have any other quick ways of getting out if this works. <laughs> did they actually like distract him enough? Oh, you. they did distract him enough. Alright, let me get this. I'm kind of surprised, but not. <laughs> Thank you for continuing my content. I appreciate it. God, they've also released some absolutely trash transfers lately. Like I remember one of the one of the abilities, I think it's I think it's Broly's. Like cuz you can get a Broly transfer. One of his abilities is to jump out of water, <laughs> like higher, which is who who really is going to use that? Ooh, Senzu beans. The oh, come on, Andy. Stop it if you can, but retreat if you need oh, to. Oh no, level four Broly. Some to help. <gasps> That's a tragedy. Stop. Well, that was technically the level three transition, but you know. That's a tragedy. Your father has been killed again. The amount of times this guy's father has been killed. Shit is wild. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess I'll go for one of these. If I can. Oh, boy. Mm. Whoa, hey, that was a rogue bullet. I sent you a super transfer. Use it to hold the enemy back. Okay, so that one, that super transfer is the one for Gogeta. Hopefully we'll see it. Just to see it. I mean, I guess I'll power up just to fire. <laughs> ah, that would have been almost enough. No. <laughs> Dang. Oh. Blinded by the light. Okay. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> so I, I, the menu still worked. So I just quit. <laughs> it just stayed white for ages. That was really weird. Yeah. I feel like that Broly played well. I think that. He knew his weaknesses and was doing his best to essentially not focus 
the super transfer and kill everyone else who could have helped. Um, very smart plays overall. But yeah, there you go. Season four. I mean, we're halfway through it now, I guess. And so it won't be that long before we get to season five. And I'm excited to see what comes next. But either way, thank you for watching. If you'd like to see more Breakers videos, two will be linked in the end site here. Click on one of those to continue. But until next time, take care. Okay, thanks. Bye.